Hi everyone, I continue on the lesson here. So we are doing this question that uh, we have to convert uh, the numbers to decimal and standard notation. And we know by this lesson here, if we have a positive number top of 10, a positive exponent, I have to go to right. And if I have negative exponent, I have to go to left. The, as the, the number of digits that, that, that I uh, the number of move that I have is exactly the same as the number of the number I see top of the uh, power or as exponent of 10. Okay, so here I see this, so I have to move decimal 6 to right. Okay, so it is 0 0.3913 times this. And I move 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And when I don't see, I need to add 0. Okay? So, which is 3, 9, 1, 3, 0, 0. Okay? So, how about here? Here you do 6, 4, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Why? Because I already have how many moves? So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 here. And then I have to add 7 zeros after. Okay, so I need to do 14 to right. Here I need to do 4 to left. Okay, maybe here I change the color. So 4 to left. And then I can show it. I have 0. Oops. I have 0 0.0729. Uh, multiple multiple 10 power minus 4 and then I do this 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 4 okay and I add 0 0 0 here okay so the answer is uh, 0 0.0000729 okay which I have to do this way. So we just do just three by three. Um, it, we, we, we need a little bit of a space between that's just three by three digits. Just just to show it, you know. Uh, yeah. Okay, but for me, when I'm when I'm marking, I don't reduce mark for this. Okay, so here you have twenty three times this. Okay. So you would say, okay, so I don't see any dot. I don't see any dot. So I add dot here and then I do 1, 2, 3, and 4. When I don't see, I add 0. Okay, so the answer is 0 0.0023. But remember, we don't count this. No, this one, this one is just, we have, to, we have to write as an agreement. Because if I don't have any digit before 0, it doesn't make any sense. Okay, that, that's it. So we don't count that as the, those moves. Okay, so performing operations on scientific notation. Addition and subtraction. Okay, so what I want to do addition and sub, sub, subtraction on numbers within scientific notation. I want to do uh, multiplication and division afterwards. Okay, multiplication and division is easier. However, in addition and subtraction, I have to do something. Okay, look at this. Let's say I have this question. What do you see here? Here you see the same power. So I have 2.3 apple minus 1.2 apple because they are like each other. But here they are not like each other. One of them is this, one of them is this. What should I do in order to uh, add and subtract? I have to make them the same. So, I have to convert one number so that they have the same exponent top of 10. So, I have to change one of them to the other or both of them to something. But because it's harder when I do both of them, so it takes time and the more work I do, the more chance of mistake. So, I just change one of them and then I can add and subtract. Okay, and then 
at the end I just have to just have to uh, convert to scientific notation if it's necessary and make it easier for myself to see okay so at the end I go to scientific notation again so if 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 my answer is not in scientific notation I change it to scientific notation okay so now I show it the first example the first example I have the same exponent so easy 2.3 minus 1.2 times this which is 1.1 1.1 times this is my answer scientific notation yes okay done how about this I don't see the same. I have five apple and I have three oranges. They are not the same as each other. What should I do? Many times I see a student, not many times, sometimes, a, a student, they add this and they add this. It's wrong. Okay? You don't do that. I have five apple. I have three oranges. They are not like each other. How can I add them? So, I make them the same. How? Look here. The reason I make a pause because I want you also to be able to think rather than just stop the video. Okay? So, I have 10 power 3. Can I borrow 10 power 2 here? Oh, yes. 10 power 3 also has 10 power 2. Okay, so it's 10 power 2 times 10 power 1. Of course, I don't remove 10 power 1 because I just borrow I cannot change my number I just borrow or I just express my number in another way oh okay so I have 5.0 times times 10 power 2 times 10 power 1 plus 3.0 times 10 power 2 okay now, can I combine these two together? Yes. So I have 50 multiple 10 power 2 plus 3 multiple 10 power 2. Okay. So I change this to red. Now, what is the answer? Can I say they are like each other? Can I say it's the same as question 10? Yes. So, I have 50 apples and I have 3 apples, so the same. They are like each other. Okay? Or I, I can say, I can, I can say now I have 50 oranges because I changed the other one. Okay? So, I, I just say this because I want to emphasize. They must be the same as each other in terms of power. Okay? So, it is 53 times 10 power 2 which is 5.3 times 10 power 1 multiple 10 power 2 which is 5.3 times 10 power 3 okay i go to scientific notation after next this one okay this one is just a big difference okay so from 10 power 3 to 10 power minus 2 is five difference between them because it's three positive and two negative okay but it still is fine can i borrow something from 10 power 3 yes i can but it's hard to say it okay so i say it in another way so for the first one i said you don't need to do anything you just add or subtract for the second one, I said, okay, borrow. Can I borrow 10 power 2? Can I? No, I can say it differently. I can say, I write 10 power 3 in another way to have 10 power 2 inside. So I express my power, 10 power number 
I express it differently to have what I want inside. Okay, so now I do 10 power 3 equal 10 power 2 times 10 power I don't know. Oh, sorry. I say I have to do minus 2. Yeah. Okay. So, I want to have 10 power minus 2 here. Okay. So, I express 10 power 3 in another way to have 10 power 2, 10 power minus 2 inside. So, when I look at my question, I don't see they are the same as each other. I have 10 power 3 and have 10 power minus 2. So, I write 10 power 3 in another way to be exactly 10 power 3, so I don't change my question, but I see 10 power minus 2 inside. Okay, so I have this here and I want this here. So, what is x then? x must be 5. Okay, so 10 power 3 is 10 power minus 2 multiple 10 power 5. Oh yes, 5 minus 2 is 3. Remember, I'm not adding anything. No, I'm not changing my question. No, I'm not changing the 10 power. No. I just have the same thing here. And I still have the same thing here. When I calculate, I still have the same thing here. Because 5 minus 2 is 3. But I write it in another way to have this inside, this inside. And I need to find x. Okay, so 7 times 10 power minus 2 times 10 power 5 plus 3 times 10 power minus 2. Remember, minus 2 and 5 together is 10 power 3. I didn't change my 10 power 3. 10 power 3 is still 10 power 3. I'm just expressing in another way to have 10 power minus 2 inside because I want it. Now I combine these two. I don't touch the other because I need it. Okay, I combine. So 7 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 times 10 power minus 2 plus this times 10 power minus 2, which is this. Okay. Now, can I change to scientific notation? Yes. I put dot here and I move 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, so it is 7.00003 times 10 power 5 multiple 10 power minus 2, which is 7.00003 times 10 power 3. Maybe, maybe no, for sure. It was easier if I express 10 power minus 2 in another way to have 10 power 3 inside. In that case, I didn't need to change my number at the end to scientific notation. No. Okay? The next question, the next example. Okay, the next example. I see 10 power minus 125. I see 10 power minus 127. This time I choose 10 power minus 127. Okay, so I change the color here maybe. Yeah. Okay, 
I write 10 power minus 1, 2, 7. I want to see this inside. Means I don't want to change 1 to 7. No, 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 no. The result is still 1 to 7. I just express another way. 10 power minus 1 to 7 have just I want express it another way to have 10 power minus 1 to 5 inside. Okay. Times 10 power what? What should be x then? Okay. So I know. It's 10 power minus 2, 1 to 7 is 10 power minus 1 to 5 times 10 power minus 2. Yes, yes, yes. Remember, I didn't change minus 1 to 7. It's still minus 1 to 7. In instead, I just express it another way to have minus 1 to 5 inside. So I write minus 1 to 5 minus 2, which is still minus 1 to 7. Okay, this one is here, this one is here, and the other one is what I found. I'm finding, okay, sometimes I see a student add something. No, 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 you don't, you don't add, you find it. It means you already have it. You already have 10, minus, 10 power minus 2 inside 10 power minus 1 to 7. How? If you borrow 10 power minus 2 and just separate minus 1, 2, 5 beside. Okay, so now do it. Okay, 3.0 multiple 10. This I don't touch. This one I write in another way. Now I combine these two. Okay, so which is? This minus uh, 0 0.05, oops, 0 0.05 times this. What is the answer? The answer is 2.95 times 10 power minus this. Done. And already the answer is scientific notation. I don't need to change it. Good. How about this one? Okay. I have this and I have this. I choose this one to express it another way to have this one inside. Ten power two is what I have. Ten power minus four is what I want. So, ten what? Ten power six. Six minus four is two. I have to I have to find that number. Okay. What number minus four is two? Okay. Six minus four is two. Okay. What I have is here. What I want is here, and I need to find this guy. Okay, how? I say, okay, I want 2. So something minus 4 must be 2. So it's 6. Okay, now it is this times this, no change, minus 5 times 10 power this times this. Equal. This one, no touch. This one, I combine these two. So it is. Oops, 5 million. This. What is the answer? So, 0 0.3 minus 5 million. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let me see. Yes, okay. So it is minus four. It is minus four, minus four, 
minus 4, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9.7 multiple 10 power minus 4. Okay, now I go to scientific notation. Minus 4.9999997 times 10 power 6 times this, which is minus 4.999. 9997 9, 9, multiple 10 power 2. So, if I change the 10 power minus 4 in another way or, or I express it in another way to have 10 power 2 inside, then at the end I didn't need to uh, go to scientific notation because it already was in scientific notation. Okay? But it doesn't matter. I just have to do more work. So, I mean, if I had this one here, and if I had this one here, and I had another number here, so then it was easier for me at the end, but it's fine. How about this? Practice. What do you do? Okay, so you have this guy. You have this guy. Okay? So. I do this. 10 power minus 1 equal 10 power 2. Multiple 10 power something. So I have this. I express it another way to have this one inside. And I want to find x. Okay? So, it is that this equal, this is what I have, this is what I want inside, so this must be this. x is minus 3, so I have to ask myself, x plus 2 must be minus 1. So what is x? So x is minus 3 then. Okay, so I have this one, I have this, I want to express it in another way to see 10 power 2 inside because I want to make the power the same. So equal 6.01 times 10 power 2, I don't touch, plus 5.3 times 10 power 2 times 10 power minus 3. Remember, if you combine these two, you still have 10 power minus 1. So you are not changing your question. You are not adding. You are not just removing. No. You are just rewriting it in another way. Rewriting. So, I, so you are rewriting this in another way to have in this inside. Okay? So equal you don't touch these you just combine these two okay so it is 6.01 times this combine so plus uh, 0 0.0053 times 10 power 2 Okay, so I just uh, maybe, oops, that's bad here. Okay, so, yeah, very good. What's the answer? The answer is 6.0153 times 10 power 2. Okay? And done. My answer is in scientific notation. Perfect. How about here? What should I do here? Okay. So this time I want to choose this one. Okay. So it doesn't matter. I choose this one. So I have this. I have this. And I choose this one. 10 power 6. And I write 10 power 6 
in another way. I don't change it. I don't add. I don't remove. I just rewrite. Just express indifferently. Okay, 10 power 6 is 10 power 5 times 10 power something. That something should be 1. So 10 power 6 is 10 power 5 times 10 power 1. Okay, so I do 9.3 multiple 10 power 5 plus 8.923 multiple 10 power 5 multiple 10 power 1. I combine these two. It's 9.3 times 10 power 5 plus 8, 9.23 times this equal 9.3 plus 89.23 okay which is 98.53 times 10 power 5 9.853 times 10 power 1 multiple 10 power 5 which is 9.853 multiple 10 power 6 okay yeah okay how about next how about the next one? So here, here, which one you choose? Unfortunately, you are not here to answer me. Okay. So I do. Okay. So I just do. Okay. I don't know what's wrong here. That this doesn't work. Yeah. Just to make it neat. Okay, so here. Which one do you choose? Okay, so I have this one. I have this one. Which one you choose? To write it differently, to express it differently. Remember, you do not add, you do not subtract, you do not remove. You just express it differently. You just rewrite it differently. Okay, so 10 power minus 3 is what I have 10 power minus 2 is what I want times 10 power minus 1 is what I'm looking for what I'm just finding okay minus 1 minus 2 is minus 3 oh yes I'm right so this is what I have this is what I want and I just find it okay 6.01 times 10 Multiple minus 2 multiple 10 power minus 1 minus this. I continue. Okay. This one, what is this is this is what I want. So I don't touch it. This is what I want. I don't touch it. I combine these two. Okay. So which is 0 0.601 minus 5.3 times this. Which is 0 0.601 minus 5.3, which is minus 4.699 times 10 power minus 2. Oops, sorry. Okay. Okay. The last but not least, which one you select? Okay, I have this. I have this as well. They are not like each other. Okay, so I choose this one. This is what I have. 
and this is what I want 10 power minus 90 this is what I want okay so what do I need then okay I rewrite it I re-express it I don't change it I don't add I don't remove no I just rewrite okay 10 power minus 95 can be written like minus 90 and minus 5 now I do it 9.3 times 10 power minus 90 multiple 10 power minus 5 plus 2.1 multiple 10 power minus 90 equal okay so now I combine these two oops okay so which is um, 0 0.000093 times 10 power minus 90 plus 2.1 multiple that equal and the answer is 2.100093 times this and the answer is already in scientific notation okay so when I don't see the same exponent I choose one of them and I write it I rewrite it in another way to have the other one inside I just rewrite it I still have the same thing I still have 10 power minus 95 but I just write it this way minus 90 minus 5 okay they are still the same then I combine I don't touch one of them that I need I combine the another 10 power with the number and then when I have the same power I add or subtract how about multiplication and division multiplication and division is easier you multiple and divide the number you multiple and divide the, ex the exponent one using exponent rules and then just write it beside each other okay and then just change it to scientific notation if you have to okay so okay so and don't round please so uh, unless I ask uh, unless I tell you I tell you these numbers are approximate and I want you to round it but otherwise no don't round it um yeah here okay so six divided by three times ten this minus this because it's division so maybe i can do it this way and then it is six divided by three times this and then it's this okay don't round any anything here so right now okay the rest this with this this with this so it is 9 times 2 times 10 7 minus 2 which is 18 times 10 power 5 which is 1.8 multiple 10 power 6 i go to scientific notation see multiplication easier are very e uh, multiplication division are very easy easier than addition subtraction okay so how about here 2.4 divided by that times this which is just this uh oh no just two sorry yeah just two that's it how about this this times this times this which is uh yeah oops 10 power that okay which is 
let me see yeah okay so now i can change it so 1.5 to, to scientific notation 1.5 so scientific notation i can show this way so 1.5 um times 10 power minus 1 times 10 power minus 2 which is 1.5 multiple 10 power minus 3 okay yeah because i move decimal to right so i need the negative exponent which i have here i move on so for scientific notation okay so i can stop here and continue after to finish the practice one uh, i'm not sure how many okay so maybe maybe these are not too many so i can finish them in this video okay so how about here so it is 8.24 divided by that times 10 power 3 minus minus 12 which is 2 times 10 power 15 yeah how about here so 3.125 times this multiple this oh my god yeah yeah so 3 point 3.125 oops yes times 1.2 3 point okay something happened here so It is 3.75 times this okay and it's already scientific notation I don't need to change it this one already scientific notation here I change it to scientific notation if I don't see um, here yes here yes let me check if I all of I have all of them in scientific notation yeah so yes this one this one and this one okay so here you change it to scientific notation you can write it this way okay so now i go back i think everything is fine okay so here 6.1289 divided by this number with number oops multiple 10 power minus 4 minus my sorry 10 power minus 12 minus 4 minus 12 which is 2.2.0 forever times 10 minus 16 don't round if i just if i don't say if i say numbers are approximate you can but you will see this in future rounding appropriately how about this at the end yes this one is the end yeah okay so this is 2.14 times 2 times this okay which is 4 4.28 times 10 power 8 as you can see multiplication division is easier you do multiple or divide the number multiple or divide the 10 power and then follow law, uh, laws of exponent exponent laws for addition subtraction however you have to change them you have to uh, express or rewrite one of them in another way to have the other one inside remember you do not multiple with something extra or you remove you, you do not remove you just express in another way you still have the same thing okay and if you have a number in a standard notation you now you are able to go to scientific notation or vice versa i hope the lesson was clear i continue to topic two after this 
Thank you so much. Bye.